Whenever we use this model to interact with the database, then the connectivity between the application and the database is not required while performing any navigations or manipulations on the data. In order to understand ADO.NET disconnected model in simple non-technical terms, let us compare working with ADO.NET disconnected model and working with a laptop. In order to work with a laptop, we establish a connection to the power with the support of a plug. An adapter will be connected to the power point using the plug and the other end will be connected to the battery in the laptop. Once the battery gets charged, we can disconnect the adapter from the laptop. Laptop works with the support of battery. While using the laptop, we don't have to stay connected to the power point continuously. Now let us try to understand technically ADO.NET disconnected model architecture. Say we have a .NET application developed using any language and some database and the requirement is that we need to interact with the database using the application. But the problem is that an application can't interact with the database directly. And so we can use ADO.NET. Whenever we use ADO.NET disconnected model to interact with the database, we will be provided with managed data providers. The managed data providers for disconnected model are connection, it will establish physical connectivity with the data source. The data adapter uses the connection object of the .NET framework data provider to connect to a data source and it uses command objects to retrieve data from and resolve changes to the data source. But data adapter can't interact with the application directly. So we take a data set and we pass the data from the data adapter to the data set. Once the data is filled into the data set, an application can use data present within the data set while performing any navigations or manipulations. Whenever the data has to be sorted or filtered based on various conditions, then data view can be used. This model gets the data from the database and maintains the data as a data source at the client system which will be used by the application while projecting the data and also while performing any data manipulations. Whenever the changes has to be updated back to the database, it has to reconnect with the database. 